Hey guys, welcome to a new tutorial. Uh, today I'm going to show you how to ingest a GitHub repository into your agent. This can be useful for several different use cases. First one would be, of course, to create a Q&A bot for your repository, help users to answer questions about implementation and that kind of stuff. Another use case might be to do a more action-based agent where you uh, basically um, ingest the uh, repository and then ask the agent to code a component or whatever it might be. So I'm going to start off with selecting a repository that I want to ingest. Being a big Vercel fan, I'm going to do the Vercel AI SDK. Uh, one thing to notice, we need two things. We need the link to the repository, which is basically this. So we will just go ahead and basically copy that link. Second, we need the, the actual branch that we want to uh, ingest. So we'll choose main, but you can basically choose whatever branch you want here. So we go back to super agent and we go to data sources and we go to applications and then we add a GitHub application and we call this the Vercel AI SDK useful for answering questions about the Vercel AI SDK. That would be the description. We paste in the repository link and then we select the branch. Now, ingestion of repositories might take some time depending on how big they are but be patient it usually works and if it doesn't i will know and get back to you so let's get this working all right so the data source is now connected and we have the vercel ai sdk repository in our data sources uh link basically so next step create an agent same pro process as usual, new agent, and we choose the OpenAI one just for simplicity. And then we don't need any tools, but we will need the Vercel AI SDK data source. And so the prompt can be anything, but usually I, in, in order to test it, I, I'm just going to write use the functions provided to answer any questions. Next, we choose the model we want. We paste our API key memory if, if that's a requirement. And then we give it a name, agent Vercel, and then agent Vercel. And we create it. So next up will be to query our agent and see if it works. So let's run it. All right. So we see that the SDK is connected. We have a prompt. Let's go ahead and type something. How do I use the Vercel AI SDK? There we go. We got our response. Now you can answer, or, or, or sorry, you can ask anything uh, and you can have it generate code, etc., etc. But This is a very basic example of how you do it. Thank you. 